So about a month after we moved in, we knew we were going to have a problem because it had been warm and rainy and all the grass and weeds and brambles were growing like crazy. In the way. Family members came to help us clear dead trees and blackberries, but the ground was so wet that we could only do so much. So we decided to focus on removing the existing fencing, which was in pretty bad shape. After clearing the fencing and getting a better feel for what we were working with, it soon became clear that we were going to need to get animals out here as soon as possible to help us keep things under control. But first, we had a privacy fence to build. Matt's parents live on forest property nearby and have a wood miser, so they've been helping us big time by milling us wood for various projects, including this fence. It took a few weekends to get it done, but we finally finished the first stretch, and eventually we'll turn the corner and take it down to the road. But that's the project for another day because at this point, we have animals arriving in a month and we are totally unprepared. We figure the first thing we need to do is set up one of our outbuildings as a barn. And we like this one because it already has water, electricity, a stall area for animals, and it's next to the big pasture. But it needs a ton of work. Thank you. 
You can keep it to play with for now. Here you go. There you go. Hey, don't be um, Dad. Yeah? Why aren't you watching? Because I'm working right now. Okay, this is our first window. This Let's make sure it's still two and a half feet long. Are those going to be our goat windows? Yeah. We're going to put up a whole bunch of them here in the barn so that there's good ventilation. So, the siding's going to go right there and up there. And up there. Yeah, but right here is where the window is going to go. In here? Yes, and same with those ones right there. I think that sounds good. Is that a great plan? It's a great plan. How about we do it? Yes, so I'm going to... But I have to keep measuring. Okay, you keep measuring. I'm going to keep cutting windows. Dad, I'm inside the barn. Okay, get up. Be careful in there, okay? Mom's been researching it. I can't stress how much we appreciate all the help that we've received and continue to receive from our family members since moving here. Without them, we would have been way over our heads. We are in a season of receiving right now, whether it's help in the form of manual labor or lending of equipment and it has been very humbling for us and we can only hope to repay the favor someday. At this point, we have the barn closer to receiving animals, but we still have a pasture fence to build and another barn to clear for hay. And I promise I'll get to all of that in the next video and that you'll actually get to meet our newest arrivals. Until then, I'll see you next time.